Welcome back to Fun Learning for Kids with ST. Place value. Okay, so we have practice place value, and the directions say look at the models below. Pearls on the string represent tens, and the single pearls represent ones. Circle the number each model shows. So we can do this a couple of different ways. The first way that I'm gonna show you is just to count by tens and ones. So one way that you can do it is you can count how many pearls on a string there are. So this is gonna be tens and you're gonna count by tens. So there's only one tens, so we're gonna go 10 and then we're gonna count up 11, 12, 13, 14. That's one way to come up with the number and the number is 14 right over here. Another way that you can do it, and I kind of like this way because I like to keep everything organized, is to make a T chart. And a T chart is basically like a lowercase t, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna put tens on the left side and ones on the right side. So let's count how many strings we have of 10. We have just one, so we're gonna put a one over here, and how many individual or single pearls do we have? We have one, two, three, four. So you can count those up and write it up, and you can see right here we have one tens, and for our ones, we have four individual ones. So that's also the number 14. And we can come over here and we can circle it. So let's go ahead and do that, okay? Now let's go down to the next one. Let's try the next one the way that we talked about first. We're just gonna count by 10. So 10, 20, and then from 20, we're gonna count up our one. So 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. That's kind of a fast way of doing it. And then we can come over here and we find 27 and we can circle it. The other way is to use our T-chart, okay? So we've got our tens over on this side and we've got our ones over here. So let's see how many tens do we have or how many strings of 10 do we have? We have two. And then over here are ones, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I'm gonna put that right over here. And again, it's the same number, it's 27. So let's come over here and circle it. There are two ways to do it. Okay, this time, let's just pick one of the ways. Let's do it just by counting on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna count by tens. 10, 20, 30, then count up, 30, one, 32, okay? Let's find that number 32 right over here and we're gonna circle it, awesome job. And then the last one, let's do it with our T-chart. Let's do it that way. So let's go ahead and make up our T-chart. I like the T-chart just because it keeps everything organized, but whichever way you're comfortable with, okay? So we've got our tens place and our ones place. How many tens do we have? We've got one, two, three, four strings of 10. So I'm gonna put four right over here and then count our individual or our single ones. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're gonna put our six right over here and that is the number 46. Good job. So we're gonna come over here and we're gonna circle 46. Nice job today with your place value. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Please like, subscribe, and share this video.